Hey everybody, it's your boy Celery Stick, and today we're going to be looking at how to mod Don't Starve. Now, the mod we're going to be looking at today is the RPG HUD mod. Now, this is the same mod I'm running on my channel right now in my Don't Starve series. If you haven't seen it yet, check it out. This mod starts at episode 7 with Woody, a really cool mod. So what you do right away is you go to the KLEIEntertainment.com website, and you're going to notice we're looking at the RPG HUD mod version 4. Really simple, you're just going to go right to this big green download button. Now, there's going to be seven choices. Now, there's only four choices, I believe, that will work with the most current version of Don't Starve. And the version that we're running on the channel right now is the default 25 on the current series. I find it's a good balance between inventory management and it still makes the game challenging. So you're just going to click the download button and it's going to download right to your downloads folder. So then you're going to open your downloads folder, guys, which is right here. And you're going to see our default 25 RPG HUD mod. So I right click that and I'm going to go extract to and it should dump it right here. There's the folder. We're interested in this folder right here. The next step is you're going to go to your My Computer or your computer, sorry. Open up where you've installed Steam. Now this is different for everybody and it's definitely not going to be like mine looks like. But open up where your Steam is installed. It's, I think it's like your C Drive, Program 86, something like that. You're going to go to your Steam apps. You're going to go to Common. And then you're going to find the games you have installed. You're going to go Don't Starve. You're going to go Mods. Right there, RPG HUD mod. Now. Mine's already installed because I've already been playing with it. What you guys are going to do is take this file right here in your downloads folder and drop it right into your mods folder. Simple as that. As soon as it's done, you guys can minimize all this and launch Don't Starve. Now the first thing you're going to notice, it's going to give you a quick pop-up telling you that the RPG HUD mod is installed. Okay. Now these mods are kind of community driven. so. They won't really help you support, like the KLEI guys won't support you with it. So they're just here just giving you a heads up. Now it's always a good idea guys to back up your save games. Now with Don't Starve, as long as you're playing with Steam online, it should always back them up for you so it's not really a big deal. But hey, you can always do that yourself as well. If you're interested in seeing how to do that, I might be able to do a how-to video. Just let me know in the comments guys. So you're going to go to the mods. Now you don't have to do this, but if you go there, you're going to see RPG HUD enabled, enabled, and enabled, and you're good to go. Mod is installed. And you're going to go play. Um, you know what? I'll just delete this one right here because it was just a practice. And we'll go practice. We're going to go start. A, I just chose Wilson real quick. We'll just wait for this to load. I always think these hands are like super creepy. Oh. And that looks like a furry bum. All right. Here we go. And there you have it. There's Maxwell. And there it is, guys. Check it out. We got our backpack. We got our, I guess, our armor position, our amulet, our hat, or our helmet, it could be, or our hard hat, <laughs> and of course our tooling. And if you notice, well, what's this? We got a pig village or a pig house. I hope this video has been really helpful, guys. I know it was very difficult for me to get this started, but once I got it going, it was really easy. Let me know if you want to see more videos like this, guys. I really appreciate your feedback. Again, thanks again. Please like, favorite, and subscribe. They really help, and we'll see you next time, guys.